Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Warwick and you're watching Gas Tax Garage. Today is another bright and early day. It seems like lately all the videos have been bright and early, but today we're heading off on an hour long drive to go help my buddy film his new car for his YouTube channel. If you haven't checked him up, his name is Extelgic, link down below, but he just picked himself up a black Corvette Z06. So let's go check him out. Alrighty guys, we are finally here. A nice hour long drive this morning, beautiful weather. There is Ilya's new, brand new Corvette. Well, brand new to him, it looks stunning. Um, yeah, he's doing all his fancy B-roll. Me, I'm just gonna do a little bit of B-roll because uh, I don't know how to do it as well as him. He believes he's a professional and uh, some people say he might be because his job is to do this. So, anyways. We're gonna do, uh, I think, a lot of different shooting today. He's gonna finally use his drone and hopefully not crash it. <laughs> and uh, yeah, maybe some uh, flybys and all the fun stuff. And I'm using a crazy gimbal, so if I'm not on camera every now and then, it's because I'm <laughs> trying to use this fucking high tech thing. But, anyways, I'll catch up with you in a bit. done right here at this location uh, we got a bunch of b-roll got some drone footage unfortunately this bond jumped out in front of my drone and knocked it so uh, yeah Amazon insurance is gonna help me out there so if you get a drone make sure you get that but we're gonna hit the road get some rolling shots I guess um, some pulls and uh, we'll see how they turn out luckily we got two drones here because I think the next thing we need is some moving drone footage so stick around. guys I am back home it was fun driving around with the uh, Ilya from Extelgic if you haven't checked out his channel be sure to check it out below uh, he does uh, far more cinematic shooting than me um, he does do it for Korea he got his career actually because of his YouTube channel because he does outstanding filming so be sure you head over there check out his actual video because mine does not do any justice um, but yeah, congratulations to him. Uh, if you know anything about the Z06, or if you don't know anything about the Z06, he has a 2009. Uh, he found it with crazy 15,000-ish miles on it, maybe less. Uh, it's a 7-liter LS7, uh, 505 horsepower beast and six-speed manual. You know, I've never been a Corvette guy. I've never really been interested or uninterested. I have just haven't been a Corvette guy. But after he's talked to me for months about looking for this car, uh, they are definitely the best bang for your buck when you're looking for a sports car. And it's a driver's car. Like, just feeling the 505 horsepower in your, in your hand in the shifter is, is completely different to my uh, R8. Obviously, automatic versus manual. If you're a car guy, you, you know there's, a, there's no comparison. But crazy enough, it is 10 years older than my R8 that I had, but it is 500 pounds lighter than the R8. It has 30 pounds less 
horsepower than the R8, same zero to 60 time, but it's 10 years older. That to me is just crazy. So I would highly recommend if you're looking at a sports car, check out the Z6 Z06s. Uh, yeah, it's just, it's a crazy car. So guys, be sure you like, subscribe, check out Exteljik's content because I'm gonna be doing a lot of videos with him over the next couple years because I also purchased the Z06. But until next time, I'll see you then.